Several Chicago City Council members tried and failed to get rid of Mayor Lightfoot's COVID-19 vaccine mandate during a special session today. The mandate has triggered lawsuits and led to non-compliance, particularly in the police and fire departments. WGN's Gaynor Hall is at City Hall with details. I believe that this vaccine mandate created a public safety blind spot. Stop the fear mongering. I beg of you. Debating the mandate at a special city council meeting today. This is not about the departments. It is about a fringe minority in those groups pushing an agenda. And it is embarrassing. And I bet you most of them are vaccinated. But they wish not to comply like little kids. City council members considered an ordinance that would have repealed the mayor's mandate requiring city workers to report their vaccination status or face no pay status. In an email to the council, Lightfoot says as of yesterday, the police department is reporting 72% compliance and the fire department is at 87% compliance. She said the ordinance was really about power. Let me just put it on the table. This ordinance strips the executive of the ability to manage the executive branch, to manage the 30,000 employees and the executive departments. That's what this is about. After hours of debate, the vote. 13, the nays are 30, the ordinance fails. Those leading the push vowing to keep fighting. I don't see it as a loss. Uh, I, I, we really need to come together and make a fair uh, policy for everyone that's not going to sacrifice uh, public safety uh, and public, our public health. I don't want to see the men and women that have risked their lives get fired over something. I just want to try to continue to work this out. The mayor says 30 people in the police department are on no pay status, but union officials have said the city has been slow to call in those officers who are not in compliance with the mandate. Reporting from the Loop tonight, Gaynor Hall, WGN News. Two women are